Hi, this is Lucid Product Reviews. Today, we're gonna do our review on 240 milliliter glass oil sprayer for cooking from Amazon. This oil spray bottle for cooking, we purchased from Amazon for $16.99. On Amazon, there are many same looking ones in different colors sold by private label sellers and we decided to go with the yellow one. We wanted to use this oil sprayer instead of using the aerosol cans because those chemicals can be harmful for your body. Let's open and see what exactly comes out of this box. But before we do that, we just want to pause for a second and mention off the bat that we have no affiliation with the manufacturer or the seller and we're not here to promote. We bought this ourselves and we hope to show you some useful and helpful information and share our thoughts. Okay, so the spray bottle in the bubble wrap. Instruction manual in an envelope inside that there are oil label stickers which are very nice and could be useful qr code for youtube instructions for trouble spraying oil mist and instruction card and booklet let's take out the bubble wrap this is how it looks very simple good looking and it's all emptied out. Let's go over some key features. The cap can be twisted open and simply squeeze the trigger. It's a food grade glass reservoir with a food grade polyethylene top. It's hand wash only and it can withstand temperatures up to 176 Fahrenheit. Apparently, it can take all kinds of edible oil as long as it's not thick or high density and doesn't contain floating particles and things that could clog the nozzle. We're just gonna use vegetable oil this time. If you were to put oil in this type of spray bottle, what kind of oil would you choose? Please let us know in the comments. The capacity is 8.1 fluid ounces. Each time you pull the trigger, exactly a quarter teaspoon of oil is supposed to be sprayed. So depending on the kind of oil, but quarter spoon of canola oil, for example, will be 10 calories. Okay, so to start, it says you should start the swing before you start pulling the trigger and release the trigger before you stop swing. So I'm guessing I should move like this. Okay, here we go. First attempt. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And there it is after the tenth attempt. Here is a closer look. Just want to see how wide it is. And it's about eight and a half inches. This time, let's try without the swinging motion. Without the swinging motion, the mist seemed to concentrate in the center and not evenly spread. This time, with the swinging motion, spray all over the foil sheet.
some areas with nice mist and some areas got overlapped and made a mess trying to spray the corner of the sheet and here's the slow motion of how the mist comes out of the nozzle there will be three tries in a row For pros, what's best about this oil sprayer is that you can stop buying those cooking oil sprays and choose the oil you like. There are no chemicals and you can use whatever edible oil you like. And secondly, it was simple and easy to use. Just fill the oil in and spray. For cons, we thought that the coverage was uneven. Each full stroke didn't seem to be a precise amount, the mist scattered inconsistently, and the fan spray nozzle seemed to make the spray come out too wide. To us, since every stroke was unpredictable, it seemed hard not to make any mess. Next, we wish that the nozzle was adjustable. Again, the mist was too widely spread, and it would have been really nice if you could adjust the degrees of the stream. This product at the end did not meet our expectations. The uneven coverage was disappointing and we feel like there are much better ones out there on Amazon in the $16.99 range than this one. So when it comes down to recommend or not recommend, we do not recommend this oil sprayer. We hope you enjoyed this video and thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe to Lucid Product Reviews. See you guys in the next video.